What's up? So this is kind of a new series I'm doing about the different kind of widget setups that you can have because I really like a lot of the iOS setups that I was seeing on the Reddit for r slash widget. And I was thinking, hey, people probably want to see how to make some of these and I think I can help out a little bit. cool because look you guys upgraded a little bit to a to an angle that's slightly higher than my other videos which i guess is kind of cool we're like I can see you like eye to eye. Look, wow, that's a little too detailed for me. Do keep in mind that this video is gonna be way shorter because I mean, look, I'm just looking at some some widget setups on Reddit. By the way, do be sure to comment down below what your favorite setup is so at the end of the week or the end of next week, I can go over and tell you how to create that specific setup. And if your comment gets uh, gets featured, I will definitely pin it at the bottom. And be sure to, to give that person some love, whoever that top comment is. So let's take a look at the r slash widget setup. So looking through, I, uh, I kind of went ahead and looked through a lot of the stuff that I was seeing, and I really liked a lot of the setups I was seeing. Like this one's really cool. So looking and seeing this one, I really, really like the wallpaper because a lot of the times when you got like widgets, I hate how it has a label. I've been trying to figure out how to get rid of this stupid like would you label. Um, currently there isn't really a way, I mean there's apps around it, but you definitely can't have that would you label uh, removed in any way so far. So I do like how it's not kind of an eyesore and they really do a good job of blending it together with the wallpaper so it's not super, super in your face. Uh, and looking at this, it actually doesn't even look like an iOS home screen to me. It looks more like an uh, app in itself and that's really cool. Although I would, if I was making this myself, I probably wouldn't want to know all of like my storage information. It's probably be a little bit too worrying because I, I, I don't have a lot of storage left in mind. Um, the weather is a very cool touch and I like how they put the apps in the bottom row right here. I really do like that. Um, maybe I would try and put something else right here just because we already have the, the weather right here. So I would like to keep that weather and maybe add the 10 day forecast up here. And if I, if I do end up going with this up, I will definitely fix this up and change it a little bit to more to my liking and show you how to change yours uh, to your liking a little bit more because obviously we're all different. Um, I do like this icon pack. I'll probably have to go and find that somewhere online. Um, let's go to the next setup. So our next setup right here. Oh, wow. I really like this one. Um, I'm not a fan of these kind of glossy icons, though. Uh, yeah, I'm not a fan of these kind of glossy icons, though, at the bottom here. Although I, I do kind of like that camera app icon. That's that's kind of a funny icon. Um, tweet deck and the mail uh, they look a little bit saturated to me I definitely would not go with this icon pack but I do like the blur with the space background I think that looks really cool and again this person did a really 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 good job of making sure that their their widget text doesn't stand out too much it really you can't even tell that it's there if you're just straight up looking at this and they added the blank icon up here I really like that um, yeah overall this is pretty good I'll give this one a four out of five. I don't know what my metric should be, a four out of five. Uh, my first instinct is go to go to Danny DeVito. Um, it's an old joke. No one finds it funny anymore, except for me, but I'll, I'll give it a four out of five Danny DeVito just for now. Uh, Cause I don't, I'll call them widgies. Four out of five widgies. Let's go with widgies. So I give this one a four out of five widgies. This first one I will give a five out of five widgies just because I really like what they did with it. Wow, I really like the, the minimalist aspect of this one. So this one, I really like the app icons. I don't know what pack this is and the wallpaper. It's very minimalist, um, although I don't really like this widgy icon. I mean, I, I, it is good, but I would definitely improve it maybe by just getting rid of that, using one of the blank icon apps and then just putting the time there. Um, I think would look really nice on this. But other than that, all of these icons look really, really nice, although they can get confusing without labels because like, I'm not too sure. I know this one's probably a calendar or a mail, um, and this one's alarm, and this one's some sort of shop. But other than that, it's kind of hard to tell what these app icons are. Camera messages. Um, yeah, like this is Safari, maybe? I'm not too sure what that one could be. Maybe I'm just stupid. <laughs> maybe they're really clear, but I don't think so. I can't really tell. Maybe this is Twitter. I don't know. So yeah, I'll give that one a four, four out of five. I mean, I'm sure there's a learning curve. You could probably get used to what the icons would be, but I'll give this one a four out of five. Don't you just like how, how I kind of blend in with my room? So it's kind of the, I, uh, whatever. 
Um, next up, wow. Okay, so I definitely see people really liking this one. This is probably one of those. Oh, by the way, that last one's a four out of five, uh, just because of that middle widget, but oh, four and a half, four and a half, we'll get a four and a half. Um, so this next one, I definitely see um, both sides here, and people are probably really not, people really, probably really like this setup, but I don't like it at all. <laughs> I'll give it a three out of five, because I definitely see where people are coming from where they're like, oh, I really like it. This is a really cool app. I've never heard of cloud battery, but I'll definitely have to look into that. Um, but as far as just everything going on, I definitely like to go on the more minimal side, as you can see with some of my previous setups. But this one has got too much going on. Like me looking at this visually is just like, there's a lot going on. Uh, I'm a high school student, so in no means am I like a design expert or anything. Just for me though, if looking at this is like just way too much chaos going on. Um, if I were to kind of fix this up a little bit to more to my liking, um, I would definitely go with a just straight white wallpaper. Like just it being all white would be really cool. Um, getting rid of the, some of those app label icons. I know that cloud battery is probably still gonna end up being there. And then we could probably get rid of some of these apps like uh, the weather app. We don't really need that on our home screen because we could use a widget and I think the widget would look pretty nice on this home screen. Um, other than that, you, everything else I think looks good. Probably just put that weather up there so it's either a swipe one. I think that would look cool. Um, and I give that one, yeah, three out of five. Uh, and let's go to, let's see some last ones. Yeah, one more for today. This one really speaks to me because there's only one left. Uh, like, can I not see full image? So maybe they took down the image. <laughs> so maybe not one full more for today. Um, wow, okay, okay, okay. This is um, six, six out of five. I give this one a six out of five. I really, really enjoy this one. I kind of hope this one wins because I would like to look further into this one. I'm not even, wow, okay. Yeah, this is really nice. So I think the wallpaper really adds to it and it gives it more of like a, more more of a feel and I do really like these white icons. Maybe they could be red, but maybe that blends in too much. Actually, I wouldn't even like that. Yeah, this is perfect. I, I would not change this at all. Um, and if you guys want to see how to set this up, I could definitely do a video. Be sure to comment down below if you want to see that video. But yeah, this is this is really nice. Um, definitely gonna drop this one a like. Yeah, yeah. And again, I see a comment here, and I do want to go over this. How the the weather is kind of off sometimes. Um, like it doesn't show up the same as it would in other places or it doesn't show up the same as it would in the Apple weather app. And that's not on Widgie's, that's not Widgie's fault. It's actually the API that Widgie was using. I was gonna show you, but again, this isn't one of my tutorial videos, so I can't show you stuff on my phone. Um, but yeah, so Widgie sometimes reports the weather a little bit off. So it'll say 30 degrees, but it'll be like 35. Uh, not really a big issue for me. I mean, it's like, you could say, oh, it's around like, obviously I, li I live in California, so it's not really 30 degrees that often, but like, uh, sometimes it'll say 70 and it's really 75 where the disparity of that isn't too big and I don't think that's as big of an issue I think that's okay um, anyway that's probably gonna be it for me today these are my five best widgets uh, if you stayed to the end I am very impressed that you you even stayed I'm not even helping you with a tutorial I'm literally just speaking to you but this is really cool I, I like the engagement here um, yeah, again, comment down below if you want to see. Definitely be sure to drop a like. I didn't even beg for likes. I forgot to do that. It's fine. I'll beg for likes right now uh, <laughs> for you, those of you who actually stayed, which is a very few amount of you. Um, and yeah, subscribe. Although, yeah, just subscribe, I guess, if you want to see more like this. And be sure to comment which one you really like because at the end of the week, I'm going to go through and see which one got the most comments of people saying they liked it. Do be sure to subscribe if you want to see how to make some of these setups. And if you really want to see any of these setups, again, comment. And I'll go over how to make it in the at the end of the week so you can follow along and see how to make these setups.